How's it going here, future voters of Sean Gannon, future president of the United States of America? And we got another beer review. We got the So Low by Goose Island Beer Company right there. Now, they advertise this beer as their 98 calorie Indian Pale Ale. I have theories on these low cal IPAs, and it's really just their IPAs and they water it down. But that's my theory. Let's pour it out. We'll see what's on the website here, and we'll talk about it. Decent pour, decent look. It definitely looks lighter body, but we'll see. The so low. All right. What do they say online here on the website? It says, big on hops, low on calories, beautifully balanced. We'll see. So low is a full-bodied IPA with big aroma, citrus, and herbal aroma notes, and a nice balanced bitterness. If the can didn't mention it, you'd never think it was a low cal beer, but now that the cat's out of the bag, surprise. <laughs> uh, style, low calorie IPA, ABV 3%, IBUs 40, color light gold, clearly. Hops, Idaho 7, Kotow and Chinook, and malts, Pilsen, Oat Flakes, Carafoam, Carapils, Copper. All right. Now let's see if it is full-bodied and you can't tell it's a low cow. I'm gonna doubt that. Mm. Right when I took my first sip, I could smell the hops right there. It is definitely the aroma to talk about, big aroma for what it is, but it doesn't taste hoppy. Um, I expected it to be hoppier uh, on the first sip from the smell as it went in, but like you can smell the hops, but it's not that hoppy. Um, it almost tastes more like a Pilsner, and I guess that's the Pilsner malt, or Pilsner malt, I don't know. Um, I mean, it's a low-cal beer, so I don't know what I'm really expecting. Uh, and the, I mean, of course, they're going to try to advertise it as uh, just as good as a normal beer, a normal IPA, but... It is not, don't let that fool you, it is not as good as a regular IPA. I don't really taste many hops. It's not really malty, it's just very, it tastes watered down, and like I said in the beginning, which maybe I'm biased because this is what I feel it all tastes like, but it, it does taste just watered down. Um, it made me drink one, but if I was gonna drink lots of just light beer, honest I'd go to like other big brand name like beers like Miller Lite is probably what I would go with um, especially for the price I wouldn't say this is exceptionally better than a Miller Lite is you can always argue it's a little better it's also less uh, it's actually more calories than a Miller Lite but it is lower in the alcohol content um, I th be kind of hard for me at least to get a buzz on this thing. Anyway, um, it's a light, refreshing beer. Don't let the IPA part fool you. You can barely even taste it. I mean, I guess if you're someone who really doesn't like IPAs and you want a low malty, watered down beer, this is for you. So that's where it's at. It's not my favorite, but it's not the worst beer. I mean, I'd still drink it. But anyway, that's where we're at. I'll give it a final score. Uh, let's go with a 2.5 out of 5 for this beer, uh, just for what it is, it is. So, 2.5 out of 5 for this beer, and I will see you next time. This is Sean Gannon here, signing off.